Hi, Diana DIYer here, ready to do another fabulous craft. We are going to do a stacked book Valentine craft today. We our elements are three used books that we got at the Goodwill and we chose the green color of the day so everything was half priced. We're gonna tear the covers off of these for our craft. We're using letter stamps and ink pads, red and black. A ball of string, some craft ribbon and a scissors and a craft heart out of stiff cardboard. Okay, so first thing we're gonna do, and Diet Coke, because every craft needs Diet Coke. So first thing we're gonna do is tear the covers, uh, the binding off of the books like this. So this is how you do it. Get your glasses on. And take it like this. And tear it off. Try to get all of it. Just a little bit right here. A little bit right here. So this one. doesn't always come right off. So sometimes you have to use the scissors to scrape it off. I got that off and I got that off. So we want them to look kind of distressed and we put them in smallest to largest. And then this one was Valley of Dreams. Doesn't really matter what, what they were. You might even have some books at home that you're finished reading or don't care about anymore. You want to get to the page where the place where there's just a bunch of words. You don't want the title page or anything. So we're going to put them in stacking order. I like the clean workspace. Okay, so like this. And now on, you can say Happy Valentine's Day or February 14th or whatever, but I'm going to say Be Mine with some hearts in the middle. So you take your Take your stamp. Let's see, do I want it centered like that? Yeah, I want it centered like that. So we're gonna do our stamps. We're gonna do it centered on the end like that, or like this. Like that, yeah. We're gonna go right here. B, E, and then hearts in the middle. Heart. Heart. Can you see what I'm doing? I don't think you can. Heart. And then mine, we're gonna do mine on this one. So let me find the M. 
Let's see where we need to be right here. So M I So we stack them up like this, where it says be mine. We put the ink pad cover on this. I, I have to tell you that a day ago, I did one, I did a video, and I used a brand new ink pad. And when I, the finished product, all the ink ran because there was so much ink in the pad that all the letters just uh, bled. And so the finished product was not good. And then I finished the video, I made another one and I finished it, but I decided to do a brand new video to, to kind of show you that even a, an experienced crafter can end up with epic fails. So I decided to do a brand new video to, to let you know that you need to try and try and sometimes you fail and sometimes you succeed, but part of the fun is just trying. So for this tag that goes, we're gonna do a love tag like this. And so I'm gonna, I, I tried to do it with a punch and it's the cardboard is too thick. So I'm gonna just do a little hole here with the scissors. Try not to hurt myself. There, see I did a little hole. Oh, a little hole. So I'm gonna put this through the hole. Well, Make the hole bigger. Let's see if it'll go through. I don't think that's going to go through. Push it through with it. Well, now I need to now I need to cut clean and put this in here. Okay, it came through. Now I need to make it go through here. this now I have this cute tag that says love and I've got this ribbon Valentine colors I'm going to tie it Here, just in a bowl. Kind of on the end so that the be mine shows. This isn't wired ribbon. If they would have had wired ribbon in this kind, in this color, I would have gotten it, but they didn't have wired ribbon. And then I always trim the ribbon in a, with a, like this. 
just gives it a little finished look. And then I'm adding my little tag. I really like tags. They finish, they finish things off pretty, make with a little fun extra. Finishing it off. Putting it on. And there you have it. Be mine. A little finished Valentine's craft. So happy Valentine's Day. Easy to make. Fun to display. Thank you. See you next time.